Yo guys, it's Beast, back with some more Beastly content. Today we are going to be doing our Awaito summons. Let's see how lucky we get. First multi is Shaft. The second multi is an SSR here. Guys, what is it? Who's going to be? Do we get the Awaito on the second multi? Let's find out. Nope. Let's find out. Here we go. Here we go. The act of killing, no matter what excuse, is equally evil. Non-killing, ow. I will take a dupe of the man. I kind of wish I was getting one of the five cards that I uh, don't have. I only have five cards left to collect SSR-wise, and that's it. That's all, all the cards in the game. Five more cards to collect besides the new Aweo. He turns it in the six, but we're going to get him here today. This was third or fourth multi. Not sure. But let us go here. There is an SSR as you can see right here. What are the words gonna say? Here we go. Charge. Yep, I do believe we got the Rata Proto Aweo. In our fourth multi, we are done summoning now. We're just gonna go ahead and start working on the event. Uh, we're gonna get these event phase quests going on here. We're gonna start on these just a little bit. Uh, the event phase quests are never hard, however there's one specific quest that if you do not get done on the first day, for most of us at least, and you might not get it done. Uh, and I did get it, the last set of phase quests done literally the day before the event went away. Uh, but I was stuck on the bingo quest for so long, I hate the bingo quest. I don't know about y'all, maybe some of y'all hate the bingo quest. Or maybe you got three friends who are instantly online and y'all just have it like timed out and your best buds. Uh, and you always get exactly through that mission in one simple instance. You're all happy, but I am not that lucky. I believe we got to like the second one. We may have finally gotten through it. No, I think we still have one uh, gift to send. But we did get two gifts sent out today. But as you can see here, we were just going through and doing the missions. This is an actual R character we have loaded up. You are. If you didn't know, every card in your box is going to boost towards total combat power, and total combat power uh, is what will be giving you CP beyond boosting a character to level 100 and doing all that stuff, because once you have the characters maxed out, what's the next step but to max out more characters so that your total CP is higher and you'll get a stat boost and it'll give you a slight bit more CP power on your lineup itself. But as you can see here, we're just going through and leveling up the new Aweo, Kirio, Aweo. Uh, for me, it's pretty simple. It's usually just a matter of exchanging for some materials every now and again. Uh, doing the feather or the uh, crystal farm there, as you can see. Uh, that crystal up front, we do eventually run out of those. I think after like the last two levels, we have to farm those. But it is no biggie. There are some good events going on. We're going to be doing some of that stuff today. Uh, but as you can see here, this is what we need. We are going to be going to its actual event and challenging it for a bit. I don't believe we're actually going to be viewing that today. Actually, yeah, might as well. It doesn't take long. All you do is just do it times 10. I have so many sweet tickets. I have like 700 sweet tickets usually. Uh, and today it's like, what? What are we at today? Three something or six something? Maybe four something. I can't see. 568. Okay, so we're at a little under 600 here. We're doing fine on sweep tickets. I have been kind of slacking on playing the game, so I haven't been redeeming all the sweep tickets I can like I usually do. I'd like to see closer to a thousand eventually. Uh, the uh, new Awayo, I will go ahead and say, uh, having actually played the card already. Very interesting card doesn't do any damage besides when it gets attacked it does attack back which is pretty good it has the Tsukiyome sort of skill of where it provokes the enemy so they only attack it so everybody's gonna attack it so if there's four enemies there it's gonna attack four times so if you can get it to do good damage on the attack back then it could be a decent damage dealing unit this here is the carnival quest system uh, we are going to go ahead and clear through the easy ones here, such as the exploration map. You can literally just sweep this three times and get 200 of the carnival exchange coins. Super duper easy, as you can see here, as long as you have the sweep tickets and the exploration maps. I haven't used any maps, I have tons of tickets. This was such an easy 200 points for me. I do this every single week. This is like 60 diamonds for free. Uh, this and another one that's super duper easy to do. There's actually another one. Technically, Marathon Combat is super duper easy too, but it does take a little bit longer. Doing a few of these is super easy. I think it was three of these, so we went ahead and did this, but we're not going to go ahead and show this whole battle. Just saying, this is what we did next, uh, and that got us another 20, or 30 diamonds and 200 points. 
And as you can see there, we now have enough for the crystals because we were able to buy a few and then we also were able to farm a few and we are good now. We are raising the limit here. We made sure not to select the owl here uh, and just go through and use a few more golds on it to get it to level four. I am kind of sad about how my limit level situation or limit crystal situation is on this unit. Uh, it might take us a minute to get to level nine, uh, but we will be using the new carnival to uh, get this guy super duper boosted up. We want to see his limit at level nine by the end of the carnival. I would also like to get his RC cells upgraded a bit more than they are. We will be getting them to about level 50 by the end of this. However, it was a bit of a material crunch. Once again, when you slack off the game for a bit and you don't play it every day and get your material farmed up as much, when the event character finally does come out, you're like, oh, I can't level up a fresh set of RC cells today. This is an odd feeling, at least for me, because I'm so used to doing that. I have finally reached level 100 on player rank now, so I am player rank level 100, so there is no more player rank for me. So far, the Chapter 8 story missions have not released, however, that Arima has not released either. I'm not sure when this game released, but I do know a first anniversary should have some sort of updates of some sort. Uh, we should also have some summer banners coming out, according to uh, Kevin Chat Mojo. I'm not sure when that's going to start, but it should be relatively soon. Maybe it's going to be like the June banners for these summer banners. So then it's probably going to be the Arma next. The one we already have the skill for. However, he is on the Arabic version, so that could just be an Arabic version thing, and it could be way far away from us. Who really knows on what's going on with that Arima? And then the next thing we're going to go ahead and do here is just go through our exchange shop. Uh, I've had a couple of these shops just kind of stacking up. I do things and then I forget I even had the rewards coming. Used to, I'd redeem them right away the instant I do them. But uh, like Crystal Exchange here, there's some more sweet tickets there. Super duper easy to get those. I found some RC enhancements right here. Uh, we went ahead and did as many as we could, which 20 was fine. So we just started testing the numbers. Could we do 80? No. Could we do 70? Uh, 60 works, so we went ahead and claimed 60 of those, so 60 times 2, we had 120 of the gold RC enhancers. Uh, that should be able to get our Aweo to, uh, all level 50 RC cells real quickly. That's just our goal here real quickly, is just to get all of them level 50. And then we're still one off. I know I have them all level 50 after the making of, or after the recording of this, but I'm not sure if we got there. Actually, yeah, we should have got there. And then redeeming all the chests I have just sitting in here. Uh, I don't have enough potential material for him. However, I think his potential material is in this carnival face-off. So we will be getting his potential unlocked eventually. And then we'll be seeing what he does with the potential. Uh, we might even just go ham on some carnival quest soon. And uh, get him some stuff unlocked a little bit soon. And there we go, uh, we went ahead and bought some RC cell boxes and then just scrapped them and it, was, it gave us just enough to get him to level 50 from level 49. As you can see there, level 50, all the RC cells are level 50. Uh, now the next thing we're going to go ahead and do is go back to the exchange. We're going to go ahead and do a few more purchases here. Uh, for instance, I do believe it's the organization exchange where we actually have one of the guaranteed SSR tickets uh, claimable because we've had stuff stacking in there. Uh, I wish I would have realized I had these promotion crystals in here earlier. However, we went ahead and bought all the factor boxes out of this. Just so that we can get some more factors, hopefully get some more UR level factors. I'd like to put some UR factors on this Aweo. Uh, I usually like to put UR factors on all my units. Just because I'm trying to get the highest combat power. My current highest combat power is 322. When I put Aweo on my team, it just drops to like 307k. So I don't even know when I'm going to be actually using this guy or how much I'm going to have to do to him to actually make him even a usable character on my team. We will be getting a unit showcase out soon. However, I do believe this is getting very close to the end of the video. Hopefully you had your good luck on these summons as I did. Here was our uh, guaranteed SSR ticket. 
Uh, woo, Ryoku, we're gonna go ahead and put our dupes in and get out of here now. So, first things first, let's get non-killing out another dupe in. Uh, okay, he's level 2 now. That was my first SSR. Non-killing out can't carry his punches. I would almost even use him today. Uh, I want to try him out in a team soon enough and just see how he does. Because he's a very good unit, but I am out, see so yes, keep it beast mode.